Hey everyone, it is Stacy Lambert Creations 26, and I am trying to do a video for you guys <laughs> for the fourth time now because um, I tried to do a live with this stuff the other day and my power went out and it was out for a couple of hours so I didn't get back in here to do this video and then I tried to do one today for you guys I decided not to go live I just decided to do my video and my basset hound would not shut her mouth and quit that barking that she so kindly loves to do and I'm sure she's gonna start barking here in a few minutes because she's gonna uh, let me know that is it is her and her sister's supper time. But anyway, I am going to try to do this video for you guys right quick because I have a couple of more videos that I want to do. But this stuff that I'm fixing to share with you guys is a um, collection from Goodwill and from yard sales that I went to this past weekend. They had the big 41 yard sale here in Georgia. And so... Um, I'm just going to try to get this stuff showed to you guys because I want to share with you guys what I found. And so right now I'm having to pick stuff back up that I had put down because I had got it, you know, in the video. And yeah, so, <laughs> okay. So I'm going to go ahead and try to do this. Okay. Okay. At one of the yard sales I stopped at, I got this simple story, um, not simple stories, but snippets and stories um, paper pad. And it, it was brand new. I've done took the plastic thing off to look at it. And it's just, you know, for scrapbooking. I got that. And I found these ribbons for 75 cents for all three at a yard sale. And I got this cute little guy at a yard sale for $0.25. Cents. Um, I got a bunch of baby clothes from one of the yard sales I went to for my Reborn dolls. But I'm not going to do those unless that's something that y'all would like to see. I can do a video separately of that. If you'd like to see it, just, you know, leave a comment or something. I don't know. Um, I'm not. I'm hoping you can comment on these videos. I don't know. Um... And then I got a bag of these tassels uh, at one of the yard sales. And I got them. I'm going to try to use them because there's a whole bunch of them in here. And I'm going to try to use them in my crafting stuff. Then at another yard sale, I got this book for $0.25. Cents. And then at a different yard sale, I got this one. And this one for a dollar a piece. And I did not know that the Pokey Little Puppy had other books. I did not know that. I do now. So there's that. And I'll pay a dollar each for these books all day long. I am looking for one that is called Baby Deer, D-E-A-R, right now. It's got a little girl and a doll on the front of it. I have been looking for it. If any of you have it or if any of you know where uh, I can get it, please let me know. I am looking uh, for two of them. Um, but I really am looking uh, for one for one of my best friends. She's looking for it. So if any of y'all have it and have it at a decent price, please let me know. And at one of the yard sales, I picked up this coloring book for $2. Brand new. I cannot wait to color in that. Now, let's see. Okay. At, um, I go to Jerry's Estate Sales, and I know that y'all have heard me mention her before in my videos. She's a really sweet friend of mine, and I go to her shop a lot, and I pick up stuff from there. She has, uh, this time of year when they do the 41, and there's other times during the year I think she might do it. I can't remember, but I know she does it this time of year. Her whole shop is 50% off. So anything that you see here, if it has a price on it, it was 50% off except my, uh, no, the, the prints were, yeah, the prints were 50% 50, 50 off too. Um, but now everything, you know, is back regular price. But I got these three tags because I thought they would be neat to alter them up and use them in, you know, swaps or something like that because I want to get back into doing swaps. I got this stamp 
and I got this stamp. And then let's see. I picked up this pink um, ribbon like stuff. I got that. I got these buttons. They're all, they're like um, shells. I got those to send to a friend of mine because she's doing a, like, uh, I guess a beachy themed journal type thing. I got this bag of purple uh, beads. And there is another pack of shells and starfish. And let's see. I'm trying to show everything I, I got. Oh, I got these beads at Jerry's. So I'm trying to grab everything that I got at Jerry's so I could share with you guys. Okay, so uh, she has a book, all kinds of books. So I got that one, this one. This one. And I also picked up this, and um, it says The God I Never Knew, and it's got CDs with it and stuff, and a study guide and the book, so I can't wait to check that out. And I also picked up this Joyce Meyer uh, book. I wanted to read this, so I got that. And I picked up this adorable little Boyd's bear. I love these bears. Um, I have had several of these in the past, including rabbits, bunnies, cats. I love these. These are so cute. And I ended up only paying $7.50 for him. And he's got his little uh, corduroy overalls on. So he's so cute. And that, oh, and I got these from Jerry. So I picked up these, and these are uh, handkerchiefs, because I'm going to incorporate this kind of stuff into my um, journals and stuff. And I got two of these, and then I got this doily, and then this doily I am absolutely in love with. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? So that is what I picked up at Jerry's. Now, at Goodwill, um, at several different times, because I went to Goodwill. I go to Goodwill quite often, but um, I'm not sure that I'm happy about the fact that they still want you to wear a mask. But um, I did go in there actually, yes, not yesterday, but day before yesterday. And I didn't wear a mask, and they never said anything. So maybe they're, you know, not going to keep enforcing it. Well, I don't know. But at Goodwill, I found these because at my Goodwill, I mean, it's hit or miss, but a lot of times you can find good stuff. I found this, which I think is super pretty and would be beautiful as a dangle or on a box. Um, she's already got the little tassel um, hanger piece. So there's that one. And then I got this one here. I wish they had had more. And I got this um, satin fabric to make flowers. Oh, I got these at Jerry's and these buttons here at Jerry's. And also at Goodwill, I got these stickers here. I got these. I got these uh, pony beads. I thought were so pretty because they got that pearlescent. To them. So I picked those up at Goodwill. And I got this at Goodwill. It's a stencil. And I got these at Goodwill. And these were only 59 cents. And then I picked these up for 59 cents. And I got these for 59 cents. And I picked up these confetti stars for 59 cents. Um, I got this for 59 cents. Um, I got these at a yard sale for free. The lady, um, I had bought a bunch of baby clothes, and she gave me these for free. And then also at Goodwill, I found uh, these old patterns. I like to get these because uh, I like to wrap things up in these when I send them to people. So I got those. And 
another little uh, sticker set thingy for 59 cents and some beautiful like uh, mint green tool got it for 99 cents at Goodwill uh, the pokey little puppy I picked this up at Goodwill because it was in such great shape so I picked this one up um, I'm, I'm assuming it's not an older one it's not old I mean it's you know this one is a, a newer one so I got that and then I picked up these invitations they were in a box for a dollar ninety nine and this is what the invitation looks like and so I figured I could make uh, like thank you note cards or something out of that they are absolutely beautiful and then their envelopes you know um, it's got it came with all of it it's all in here so for a dollar ninety nine I was like I can do something with that there's a 50 count box of them so I got those now get this stuff set to the side so that is what I picked up at uh, yard sales and Goodwill over the last week and I will be back in a few minutes with another video from Hobby Lobby and the Dollar Tree and another little place, a little crafty place here that was in town. No, now I'll go ahead and do, um, let's see. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do this. There is a shop here in town that is called uh, K&T Crafting Supplies and More. And guys, I went in there and I, I mean, I spent 40 43 dollars in there but i'm telling you i was like i could have spent more money in there um they you know you can uh they're a resale shop and everything and i was just in love i got this and i was waiting to open this so y'all could see i got this for a dollar and i thought this would be gorgeous like on a book or on a project of some kind but isn't that gorgeous I was like I will take that and I'll just lay that over there and um, I know that some of their stuff is you know like um, it looks like it was you know purchased you know like from the stores and everything you know just to get stuff for resale but I got these paper flowers for $2.50. I got this gorgeous embellishment. Um, it's a it's hair pins, but I'm gonna be using it for embellishments for two dollars. There's these flowers for $2.50. Another pack of those. Then there was this I thought would be absolutely gorgeous on a cover of something for two dollars. There was these flowers. There's this tassel with, um, uh, not that well, it's trim, but, um, and there's another piece in there, but I just thought this was so pretty, and I wish I could find more of this. I love the colors on it. And then I have another little baggie of it somewhere floating around. And then I got these for $2.50. These were two dollars, and we all know how much these things cost. And yes, you know, I, and I don't care if they, you know, got stuff on a clearance or what have you, and then brought it into their shop. I don't care because I'm always about helping local businesses and stuff like that. Um, then there are these puffy butterflies. <clears throat> I absolutely love these. I will be going back to get some more because they had a couple of different sets of those. And this is another um, trim that I got that I think is so pretty. Cannot wait to use that on something. Nothing that I got um, was over $250. $250 was the highest that I paid. All of these, uh, I think, were a dollar. Because she said all the flowers was a dollar. So this whole pack of these was a dollar. 
And then I got this gorgeous, like, lilac colored trim. Look at that. And I'm, you know, I'm not sure how much it was, but, you know, the highest thing that I paid was two fifty. And then I got these for $0.49. Cents. I got this for a dollar. And hold on because there is more. And then I got these pretty flowers for a dollar. Ah. All of these were a dollar. A dollar. And those are um, like a bright pink. They are gorgeous. And I got these here for four, uh, for 50 cents a pack. There's some more of that trim. Uh, a different style of those butterflies. Some gold sequins for 49 cents. And these packs of stickers. And there was like three different packs. So I wanted to see what was in here. And they were 25 cents for a pack. So, uh, okay, so we got a butterfly. We have a boat. Oh, we have a little octopus. Uh, a dump truck. And I think that's a submarine. And in this other pack, there is... A butterfly, a panda, a little girl, a little ballerina, another octopus, and this looks like a, a cat. And then in this last pack, there's this pretty owl. Um, I'm not sure what that is. A, a police car, maybe? I can't tell. I don't know. <laughs> it's something. I don't know. Um, there is a fox. Um, hmm. I don't know. A bus, I guess. And then there's some other kind of little, I don't know, person, I guess. And there's another pack of these. And then uh, I did pick up this uh, little tube of glitter. And I got this stamp. And this stamp. And this stamp. So, uh, and those were $2 each. And that is a local shop here um, in Calhoun, Georgia. And it's called KT Crafting Supplies and more. So, all right. So, guys, I'm going to stop this video here. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. Um, I would like to get, you know, people in here um, that would like to do some swaps and, you know, do some, like, challenges and things. Because I'm trying to really get my Crafted Mojo to back. So, if y'all can help me do that, I'd appreciate it. Um... I will be back with another video from the Dollar Tree and from Hobby Lobby. Have a blessed day. Bye.